Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Minecraft. So today we're going to work on some solar panels uh, for IC and uh, just do some other stuff in IC as well. Um, so there's the low voltage solar panels and this is the regular IC panel. So we need to make a, a few of these guys yet first. So <laughs> probably should get started on that unfortunately. Uh, probably should have been a little more prepared. Uh, I need some tin cables as well, if you can notice. And I don't know if we even have any more tin cables sitting around. Uh, no, I don't, unfortunately. So we're going to have to do that as well. So the best way to do that is probably just raw tin, actually. So uh, let's go ahead and do that. By the way, I did some gold upgrade chests. Basically, it's just uh, iron plate with gold plates around. Iron, Yeah, iron plate and gold plate around it. And it gives you an upgrader. Uh, here it is. And you just right click it and you can see the difference in size. So uh, give me that extra oomph because uh, some of the chests are starting to, you know, starting to become a problem, right? So uh, let's go ahead and just upgrade the speed on this for a second. And there we go. And then we can put you in here. And there we go. Might as well wait to the next one here. Uh, good luck there, buddy. I don't even think uh, anyone has flight. Unless they're really rushing it for some reason, but I'm not. And I could, I guess. I guess I could look into making a jetpack. We won't tell them, though. Uh, it wouldn't be a fast enough jetpack anyways, to be honest, for their needs. So here we go. We're going to make eight of these anyways for now. And now uh, my adult will use the pure tin anyways. And uh, yes, yeah, so. And then we got to make these guys here. So there you go. And they're gonna be pain, but whatever. And oh, I guess I overmade that. I guess it doesn't really matter though. And then here we go. We got eight of these guys made. Awesome. And there you go. And we can make eight solar panels. So you can make eight or keep some. Uh, honestly, let's make let's make seven because we already have a solar panel. And then that way I have the resources if I really need them for something else later on. And there you go. And so what you want to make now is an IC2 transformer. So if you go here, you can check out the transformer. It's one of the coil things. I've done them before, of course, but uh, we have lots of copper anyway, so it's not a big deal. So uh, iron ingot, iron ingot, there you go. And so we'll go ahead and make the coil. Here. And there we go. And what else we got here? And then, oh, <laughs> go figure. We need more of these guys. That's all right. We made a bunch anyways. And why am I going over here? Because I knew I need something else. And then I, oh, yeah, the wood. That's what it was. So like I knew I needed to leave the area. just didn't know what I was doing, to be honest. Uh, let's get rid of all this crap in my inventory. And, uh, yeah, so we'll go here again. And we'll make, I don't know. Make 10 for fun. Make it like an odd number just to be really annoying. And then you put this one in with all the solar panels around. And there you go. You got a low voltage solar panel, which is eh, Mickey Mouse at best in my opinion, because it's not like it's going to really do that well. Uh, I mean, it's going to probably be nighttime. Oh, it tells you how much EU it's generating, though. That might be a new feature. I don't know if they used to tell you that, to be honest, in the, the panel, but... Uh, it's quite low, to be honest. Actually, it looks like it's actually enough to... Oh, it's still draining slightly. So, yeah, 8U taking it still too... This is still draining too much out of it. <laughs> so, um, maybe what we need is, like, some storage for that. So, uh, anyways, there you go. That was the compact solar. So, uh, let's check out IC2 CSU here. Or, Electro calls it. Sisu, Sisu. So we're going to need sulfur, some uh, pulverized lead. Oh, wow. That was just amazing. That was just sitting there. Uh, let's see. You're going to need some copper cables. You're going to need lots of bronze. Oh, look at this. What a coincidence. And uh, yeah, so there you go. Uh, I don't know if I made a bunch of these, to be honest. Oh, I do have a bunch. I wasn't sure if I made a bunch or not. So it's like, eh. I was prepared for that part too. Just forgot about it. There you go. Three of them. And there you go. That's it. 
Uh, I probably won't use this one up, but this is a Sisu, Sisu, Sisu. So it outputs 128. Basically, boom, 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 boom. Unless they all have power upgrades, etc. Right? So you wouldn't want that. You would have a lot of pain and suffering and crying. Uh, the next one is an MFE, and I'm pretty sure MSU, MS, MSU, there you go. Oh, MFS, there you go. It's been a long time. Yeah, uh, yeah you use an MFE, so just double checking. It's been a while. Uh, plus, you never know in these mod packs. Somebody might have just screwed around just to piss you off, right? So it uses gold cables, which is cool. It uses energy crystals, which is... And uh, this dust, and you can make this in. Here's the question: Can I make it in my crusher? Interesting. So you can't. It doesn't use your uh, other one, unfortunately, for that. And then your redstone. So you need nine of those, and you're gonna need uh, a bunch. But honestly, you're gonna even need more than that technically, because you're gonna need one for each crystal. So, oh boy, four four diamonds for nine. And nine gives you one, and you're gonna need four. Nine, eighteen, twenty-seven. Oh wait, we're doing the math wrong. No, you need four per each one, right? So four, eight, sixteen diamonds just for the one, and then so sixteen. That's four, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so I think that might be the right one. Somebody can correct me. Probably doing it wrong. <laughs> there you go. Honestly, with this, Maceraiers use very little power, so this one would be actually probably make sense doing it that way. And I don't know if you want to go one more. It probably would be too much, to be honest. But there you go. That's actually working really well. And I guess we could throw this in here. Might as well keep the power going. Okay. Go over here. And, uh, yeah, so we got re-battery. Probably not going to use that right away. Generator. Got these for circuits if I ever need them. Um, and then, oh yeah, we needed diamond uh, as well. So, we just needed a bit, but we're going to need a couple of diamond cables at least. So, four of them. For some reason, I think these were actually, they gave a bit more than normal, but I could be wrong. We'll see here in a second. Don't even get to see it. Oh, they do give you four. Ah, oh, you might need them again. And then you got your rubber here somewhere. There you go. Now, these require two wins, right? So it's two rubbers, I think. Yeah, so... If you look here, it's uh, two rubber and the, the wire. So I guess we'll just go like that. There you go. There you go. So we got that part done. And then we got, we should have one of these still around here. There you go. Two of them. We're kind of running low. And uh, yeah, these should be almost done. And then we need redstone. There you go. I'm actually surprised this is not finished yet, to be honest. I guess it was really slow. One, two, three. There you go. That's enough to make a bit anyways. So here you go. So you put this in here and boom. There you go. And it's a compressor. Just double check. Yep. Compressor. So put this in the compressor. Where we had made the lapis plates a long time ago. There you, there you go. And I think they even stack now. Back in the day they wouldn't stack, but I think they stack now, so... There you go. Awesome. Yeah, I think that might be the right math anyways for what I need eventually if we go there. So there you go. This is the MFE. So you put the MFE down. 
The MFE is 512 output, so boom, 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 even more. Uh, but definitely worth it in the end, uh, just because, well, it stores even more power. Uh, 4 million. But then there's even one more badder one, and that's the MFSU. Oh, and we got a quest complete on that, by the way. Um, and that's the MFSU, and uh, it's even more powerful. Uh, we might not be able to do it, but we'll see what we require. So you need Lapis, and it looks like it has to be the ground down Lapis here, which means we need to pulverize it, macerate it. Yeah, so I need to macerate that, and we'll get that done now. Lots of macerating this episode. Okay, so we'll have that going. Then uh, we need to have uh, advanced chips. Oh god, 6, 12, so you got 12, 13 of them, I guess? Oh, and you need an advanced machine casing, which that that's probably going to be the, the trigger point for us here. So you need the advanced alloy. So you're going to need iron, bronze, and tin. Iron, bronze, and tin. Iron, bronze, and tin. So you got uh, iron. We already have iron in here. Bronze and tin. There you go. So iron, bronze, and tin. And sometimes there's other mixed metals too. So yeah, this one doesn't. I've seen packs where there's like multiple types of mixed metals. So it's up to you if you want to find other recipes that might be a little better on your uh, usage or whatever. And then you throw this in the compressor and it'll do its thing. There you go. That's working okay. And let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. I know that'll eat it up, but, but that's fine. As long as they don't run out of power, I don't really care. Nah, they're good. Okay, so that is how you make the uh, advanced alloy. Advanced alloy is badass, so you got the advanced alloy going. You need steel plates, which, of course, we have steel plates. Not a big deal. And then what you need is something a little more special, uh, which is carbon plates. And carbon plates are made out of raw mesh, these guys... Which is, guess what? Something we already have, oddly enough. It's almost like you think I was a little prepared for this. Don't think that. I would never prepare for the future like this. Oh god. There you go. And then you put them back in again, and there you go. And they're compressed again as well, keep in mind. So, seems like compression is the, uh, the, the game here today. So, we'll get those going there. One, two, three. Okay, so with that going, we got those. We have you going. Um, I do need to make more of these guys, honestly. And the best way to make them seems to be, in, in the simple sense, would be probably the dense one. But then again, these take eight. If you look at the cast on these, they're eight anyways. So whatever makes it easier is easier. There is no duplication on this. Um, if you have a lot of tin, go for that. If you have a lot of iron, go for that. And iron again. And it also depends what's easier machine-wise. Honestly, I would say because we have uh, all this in use, this would be probably the easiest machine-wise right now. Um, I hope these guys don't actually have a problem. Uh, I've never done an ingot cast, have I? Uh, no, you have not. I don't think. So what we should probably do is consider putting those ones in ingots right now. We'll just use iron since it's simple. Or you could use a brick, honestly. You don't have to waste uh, a piece of iron. Don't think that. Uh, so we're going to put an iron here anyways for my usage anyways. And I meant to... There you go. And we need a piece of casting, which I think I have a bunch here. I should have thought of that sooner. There you go. So we're going to put this guy in here, and he'll melt really quick. Well, he can melt quicker. <laughs> and then what we're going to do is we're going to cast it on there. There you go. Molten aluminum brass. We're going to put it on there. And then uh, we're going to one, two, three, one, two, three. And then we're just going to pour the rest on here. There you go. Oops. And that's it. They're, they're empty, I think, right? Yeah, okay. And then we'll put the iron in here. One, two, three. 
Oh, no, we ran out of lava. If you couldn't have a worse thing happen right now, it would be run out of lava, basically. And we ran out of lava. Uh, we have buckets around here, but... Where did you put them last? There we go. I'm just going to get two buckets. Lasted so long. Eventually, we won't be using this at all, but I don't want to waste time making tanks or finding a tank. And Actually, the tank itself could be taken, too, but... We're doing this anyways. Okay. Oh god. Okay, so lava. And we're gonna go get our buckets here. One and two. And then hell home. Pretty cool, huh? Okay. Oops. And then home. Awesome. And then outside we go. And then one and two. Okay, so that was embarrassing here for this part, but uh, whatever. One, two, three. There we go. And we'll put you guys in there. We're going to put you in there. I'm just going to full iron it out. Okay, so we got the iron going here. And then we're going to replace this with... Um, we're going to put this up here. We're just going to get the plate here. And then we're going to go one, two, three, one, two, three. And then we're going to start this. There you go. Technically, we could go faster on this too, but I'm a little lazy. I'm also a little slow at times. There you go. There you go. There we go. And they've cooled down. Oh, I don't know why I got that. I guess there was one there already. And we can put this here. There you go. <laughs> one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. There you go. How awesome is that? There you go. So eight. There you go. I feel like uh, we should get more. Yeah, because if you do them in fours, right? Four, eight. Uh, I'm thinking like four, eight, sixteen. Oh, whatever. We can do uh, another two, I guess. Doesn't hurt. There you go. We're using up a lot of this time, but that's fine. There we go. And, uh, yeah, so that should help us with the, the machine thingy, my boppers, anyways. And then after that, it's uh, aluminum. Oddly enough, it is aluminum plate. It isn't something else, which kind of makes me sad, because aluminum plate is probably the only thing I don't have as a plate right now. So if you think about it, it's not as nice as you'd want it to be. Uh, aluminum plate is right here. And I actually don't have a lot of aluminum there, too. That's actually bothersome. I need to mine at a higher uh, higher amount, I guess, in the future. There you go. Can't believe this is still going. All for IC stuff. That's the fun part about IC. IC is always a bit more of a challenge like that, but it's it's a good thing too, you know? It's not a... I never really take it as a bad thing. It's just that is IC for you. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of you anyways. There you go. You're done. And then for you, I guess we'll just go one, two, three for now. Oh, you can't even keep up. That's kind of sad, actually. I believed in you. There you go. It is daytime. I wonder if this would burn, though, if I were to increase the speed of this. Because that's 8. That'd be 16, right? Like, would it burn or would it just faster packets? Because it would be faster packets than anything. 
the cable probably would outpace it anyways. Yeah, so it still does the 8U a tick, so it's not so bad if you think about it. Okay, here's more. Uh... There we go. We did it. 17 machine cases. Now we don't have to worry for a while. Okay, so we were working on the advanced ones, which require the carbon plates, which required us to actually put them in the compressor. And then we'll speed it up. One, two, three, of course. There you go. And we just needed one, right? So I missed the recipe there. Oh, yeah, there you go. Ah, we got two perfectly. Okay, so now we can make the advanced one. Ta-da-da. And then we can, uh, we can't do these guys yet because we still have to make the, ooh, we have to have a bunch of elite circuits, which I think we use them all. So we have to go and actually deal with that as well. So fun times, my friends, fun times. Uh, let's see here. Oh, wrong one. And you're going to have to have how many? They're in every single one. So 6, 12, 13 of them, and I can only make 8 right now. Yeah, without more of these guys, we're we're game over right now. So we're going to have to do that next. Uh, I think it might be time to just go like this for some of the materials, because it's killing me, unfortunately, in a bad way. And we're going to need more of these too, but it's not really these as much as we need the other guys. So um, we're going to make this and... Uh, yeah, sorry. An iron. Just basic iron, which is pretty nice. So, here you go. And 16, 32. So, 8. Oh, yeah, I guess if it's 8, it would be 8 to... Yeah, that makes kind of more sense. There you go. And then we can... 1, 2, 3. There we go. I don't know how well the power would keep up there, but this thing is full anyway, so power wise is there. Not a problem. It's this power we have to worry about. Makes me even want to consider doing it higher. Okay, it can't keep up with the four. Good to know. Plus it's a waste of use way more uh, power time thing for that, right? So It's because these cables can't keep up. If you were to speed up these cables, actually I might do that for fun later. Yeah, we're done now, so I'm not going to bother doing it. But if you were to speed up these cables, they probably would work then. Look at that. 64, my friends. Okay, so... Unfortunately, I'm not doing good here for that. So we need redstone, of course. I know we were pretty low on redstone again, so let's get some fresh redstone. And there we go. And I know we don't have quite what we need still. I was hoping it would show up really fast there, but I guess we should go to the next thing. And yeah, there you go. Ah, screw it. Pretty sure I just do myself or something else later. Okay, so we got those guys, and now we have to do all the other stuff. So we got the advanced machine casing. And then we need the MFE, of course. And then we need uh, each of the lapis. So we need to get the lapis out of here. And then there was probably something else in there too. No, nope, maybe that's it. Oh, the crystals. There you go. So let's make the crystals first. Six crystals. Here we go. And then there you go. You got the MFSU. And there she is. So the MFSU is like your god block basically. Um, it holds 40 million RF, but it puts out 2,048 RF a tick, or sorry, EU a tick. It'd blow everything unless if you get upgraders for everything, uh, transformers. And I don't know how many you need even for that this day and age, but they're expensive because a transformer is an MV upgrade, a machine casing. It gets a bit messy. So what you want to do is just go for the full transformer experience, uh, basically. So... You got an MV transformer, you got your HV transformer that uses an MV transformer. Uh, so we know that, right? Um, and then the MV or then the HV goes to the highest one. So, and it uses lapis crystal. If you can cry more about something, that would be probably uh, the cake there. So, one, two, three, four. Um, might as well macerate that, get that started. Please kill me on that one. And uh, even more 
redstone, if you can believe that. Oh yeah, see, I told you we didn't have much redstone left. Okay. So we'll do the transformers. Now, I don't think an MV transformer, for example, can step... I might as well try it anyways. Uh, try to MV, like, an MV and see if it can step down further. Pretty sure it can only step down, like, little steps, so I don't think you can take the highest and say, oh, it's only going to output 32. It can only output the one, I think. But, I mean, it might be different now. I've never played with the stepping, and so I've never, I've never paid attention to it, actually. So I'm interested in that. I know it does stepping. I don't know what it means. So... Basically, this is your high voltage going in here and the low. So MV does 512, and look at this. So you can step it down. Yeah, you don't want to play with that. I hope that resets it. Output is 128, input is 512. Okay. That does not look like the same as the normal one. We're going to have to make another one just to make sure we put it back to what it was. <laughs> Doesn't matter. We're going to have to anyways with the uh, the setup we have here. So, was it like this? Yeah. So, there you go. So, it's set up. Oh, okay, it is the re right one. Okay, so this is your high. This is, uh, this is your high, and these are the lows. So... Um, they go to 128, which would, of course, still blow everything up that we have right now. So you're going to have to step it down even more uh, with an LV. And this is the LV one, which, of course, requires the coils and everything else. Uh, here we go. And coils around wood, right? So I think we're fine there. Oh, no, it's a piece of iron. I knew it was around something, just didn't know it was iron. Okay. So this would be your coil, and this would be your LV. So there you go. So basically what you do is you have this one here, and then you have this one here. So they daisy chain. So anything coming out of here is the, uh, the 128. Anything coming out of here is 32. All those are 32 machines, right? But this against that would still blow it up. So we need to make an HV version now. So here's the HV, and there's an EV version, which... Uh, we don't have to worry about EV is kind of like, well, I don't know if there is anything EV at this point, to be honest. So, uh, so we're going to need ooh, some of these guys again, sulfur. We're definitely going to run a little over time probably for a couple minutes, but it'll be worthwhile to get this up and running. So, uh, requires three ins HV cable. I don't even know how to make three. Okay. So it's a piece of iron. Okay. Oh, look at that. That. That's already done, basically. Okay, so we get that done, and we're going to do this one, and then we're just going to do one. There you go, and we might as well take you. Oh, we don't need you. Wait, what? What the? There it is. So I, I knew I needed something, but I wasn't sure what. So we're going to have to... Oh, so I was looking at the wrong one, so I don't actually need that. This is an easier recipe in the end. Uh, so we need some rubber, of course. Here we go, and uh, sorry, I must have clicked the wrong one. Wait, did I click the wrong one multiple times like a noob? I did, didn't I? I clicked the same thing over and over like a noob multiple times. That's great. So it was gold the entire time I needed. I didn't need anything else. Okay. Uh, oops. One, two, three, four. Might as well use it up. Wait, that's not double ends, is it? Oh, it is. Okay. Just doesn't look like it to me. Okay. And then we wanted to make this guy again, which is these guys and this guy. There you go. And there. Oh, yeah. There you go. And there we go. And there we go. So we now chain this one like this. And then we put this one, his, his output, he only has one output. Every other side is an input, right? So then for this guy, you want to put them in like this. So there you go. And then so any IC machines connected to this part, right now those ones are fine. This is MV. So uh, this is 32, 128, uh, 512, and, uh, well, directly out of this is 2048, which you don't want at all for sure. Um, so, yeah, so we'll basically I'll install this. And I'll get it in here. And uh, yeah, I think that'll be it for now. 
I'll probably play a bit more uh, IC in the future. I'll probably take a little break between it, or maybe I will do more IC next time. I'm not quite sure, but uh, either way, I will reconstruct what we have here for a bit and then uh, go from there. So uh, have a wonderful day. Oh, you know what I, I needed? Geo. I never made the geothermal, and it was part of a quest. We have a bunch of these, right? Yeah, and we have broken glass somewhere still, don't we? There you go. And do we have a generator? Yeah, we have a full generator. One generator, perfect. And we have any... We don't have actual any smashed up iron right now. Uh, that's aluminum plate. Here's an iron plate. There we go. There you go. This is... Uh, might as well do it for the... The quest, we didn't actually do any quest rewards too, right? So I uh, might look into that too. So one, two of these, and we need to get full glass as well for this, and then the full glass. So one, two, three, four, and your full glass. There you go. So this is a geothermal generator. You just feed it with lava to get power. I might get some. I don't know. Uh, it might just be more. I just wanted the quest anyways because uh, I haven't... I haven't been grabbing the quest. And you got the solar panel reward as well. Keep in mind. Because that was there before. Oh yeah. Look at all the loots now we got. Okay. We got that one. We got the geothermal one. We got the solar panel one. And we got the advanced alloy one. There you go. We'll open it. So we got bottle enchant. Meh. Got brick. Meh. We got purple crystal skulker box. Meh. And we got ironwood, meh. <laughs> I would say meh, meh, meh all along there. So yeah, look at that. We did a big chunk of IC. That's awesome. So HV, I don't know what the, oh, MV. What? Six gold ings cables? Are you serious? Uh, that's it. We're overtiming. That's embarrassing. Oh, what the hell did I just click? I can't have that on my record. There you go. One, two, three. That's like so horrible. Oh no, you have the wrong method. There you go. Okay, we're... Oh, it looks like we did something right there. It doesn't matter. One, two, three, four... F I'll just get these done. There you go. And... So this one's complete now? Yep. Meh. <laughs> And what about this one? Why didn't we get the HV one done? Oh, they want this six ins uh, cable. We we did the iron one, but we didn't actually do the full iron. So let's do that. And uh, just double it there. And we'll do the, so it was like, was it three ins or something like that? So it looks like that, right? There we go. And we can claim that. And then we can meh again, probably. Meh. There you go. And now we've completed pretty much. Yeah, so we're good. We're good. Glass fiber is a nice cable, but we're going to have to probably macerate something down. Yeah, the dust and pulverized silver. Meh. Anyways, guys and girls, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.